Hi, Cameron here. In this video, we're going to look at uploading files to assets and work orders. You can upload many different file types, from images to documents to spreadsheets to notes. Let's get started. I want to upload a photo, some financial data, and a manual for the parts. I go to the Files tab. There are three types of uploads you can do. You can upload a file, a link, or a note. A file comes directly from your computer. A link comes from another web page. And a note is a standalone upload with a name and a brief description. We're going to be uploading a file. Click the Add button at the bottom left. We're going to start with our default image. This is the picture that's going to be associated with this asset. Go into our directory. Find the picture we're looking for. Wait for it to upload and hit Save. You can see the image is now in the top left. If we want to view the full-size image, we just click this link here, and it opens up in a new tab. We also want to upload an image of the fuel gauge and the parts list. Close our tab. Go to New. And this time we just select Image. Upload. Pictures. Fuel gauge. Wait for it to finish uploading, and hit save. We now have the image of our fuel gauge associated with this asset. Finally, we're going to upload the parts list from the manufacturer. This is a document. Upload. Volvo truck parts list. And hit save. We want to view this, click to open, and it opens up. Now let's upload a file to one of our work orders. Go to maintenance, work orders, let's add it to work order number 11 in our main facility. I want to add the floor plan to this work order. It's a file, go to add new. It's an image type document. Look for the floor plan. Wait for it to finish. And hit save. The file can be viewed by any technician working on the work order or manager approving it. Uploading files to scheduled maintenance, parts and supplies, equipment or tools is the same. Simply find the files tab, click the new in the bottom left, and perform your upload.